Kinjasa, Salam Alaikum, welcome back. It's your tech ninja Muhammad. Uh, so today I'm gonna show you how you're gonna connect your EPEGA gamepad uh, with the wire uh, with the cable basically wired connection, not the Bluetooth connection, but the wired connection with the EPEGA gamepad. It's gonna be a very simple and quick video tutorial under two minutes or so. I'm gonna just play a little bit past 2019 with this gamepad. Yes, 2019 past. This is the EPEGA PG 1999. Uh, it's like a year and a half old, and not uh, really old. There are EPEGA gamepads pads all four years I think or something like that so let's do it then just you can have the buying links in the description for the best game pads for now uh, what I'm what I moved from the gamepad from the Ipega or the my second or the main gamepad it is this gold kit uh, uh, gamepad which is King Kong Pro uh, man it is two times more expensive than the Ipega but just the feeling the quality uh, the customizable the versatility of this gamepad is just a different level in just yes you do pay two times more but you get a lot more so let's go with this tutorial shall we so you need a cable ninjas i noticed that you have to use the cable provided in the box i don't know how but this is a micro usb cable but i tried the other micro usb cable it didn't want to connect with the uh, ipega gamepad so use the original ca uh, cable provided in the ca uh, in the box let's go Okay, Ninjas, here we go. I'm using my laptop. So what you need to do is connect your gamepad, uh, basically the micro USB uh, cable to the micro USB port. Hold the start button. Hold the start button and then I insert the, the, uh, the, basically the cable inside uh, of your USB port. So let's begin. Bismillah. Hold the start button and insert the cable. And you should hear that sound. Did you hear it? If you didn't hear it, Ninjas, repeat again. Uh, I'm going to unplug it. So it's turned off. Now we're gonna hold again start, plug the button, plug the cable, and that's it. The the LED should be here, ninjas. The LED should be here. If is it uh, if our more LEDs are turned on or if they are flashing, then your connectivity is not correct. And if you didn't hear that sound, then probably you didn't connect your gamepad with a wired connection. Let's go now and try to play uh, PES 2019. And just first one I'm going to show you here, I'm going to go to PES 2019 uh, controller uh, options and I'll just show you that it did found it. Did found it. It's called the PCPS3 Android Gamepad. You probably can see it there. It's there. It is there, bro. It is as a controller too. I set it up and you will need to adjust the L1 and RT and LT buttons or the R2 and L2 buttons here with this one, with the Ipega Gamepad. You can see by stuff, yeah? You need to adjust these ones, they are always mi mixed up. And also the the, uh, the, uh, the gaming buttons, which are the Y, B, A and X, you also have to adjust them. But everything else, the analog, the D-pad, everything works fine. And also the start and select button, you will have to adjust them. Remember that. Anyway, let's begin. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Start and uh, basically run the PES 2019 now. Let's see here. Okay, I said the video will be under two minutes, but it's not because I mentioned also the Google Kit gamepad. So sorry for that, Ninjas. I'm going to try to do it under five minutes. Excuse moi, excuse moi. Can you just, sorry for that, Ninjas. Just this, this TV is so big on my uh, table. Uh, anyway, let's start. Let's start this game. Show you right now. Okay, I'm Barcelona. So there you can just check this out. And I've been playing, I've been playing with my brother, he was using Xbox gamepad uh, on the other side and I've been using Ipega gamepad uh, on the, of course, left side. And you can see for yourself, it, com it completely works in just a little bit uh, after really, really long term use. Uh, almost, how many? Two, two years? No, a year and a half since I'm using this gamepad, I think so. Just the L1 a little bit uh, making me a uh, pain in the ass there. Uh, not a big problem, but sometimes it does get stuck or so. Probably I need to uh, clean it or something like that. Uh, probably I will have to just use some tools to open this gamepad and to fix it. Uh, this is completely acceptable, Ninjas. This is a super cheap uh, gamepad. You shouldn't expect after maybe half year or one year, you should start to see that some buttons will tr uh, find the uh, kind of get get some maybe get stuck or something like that or they're not gonna have really great sensitivity as they had at the first day that is again don't expect ninjas don't expect too much this is uh, basically two twenty dollars twenty five dollars ipega gamepad so i think this is it you get the point works perfectly here i played i even won a few times with this gamepad against my brother who used the xbox 360 controller again it lets me try to attack them there you go Check this out, so you can use the R2. You can see by itself, play around. And uh, uh, basically the sensitivity here, the touch, uh, the input, 
the input of the buttons average average but again completely acceptable again uh, i'm gonna try to use the gold kit gamepad which is two times more expensive and probably i, so I should see their progress and i should see uh, differences uh, between super cheap china gamepad and more expensive uh, china gamepad for uh, for the football this is really good the, the touch sensitivity or the touch input is uh, more than good but for something re uh, really more serious like fps games then the, you will have to basically buy something more expensive if you want to have really a uh, top level touch sensitivity and touch input i mean most of you will agree with me come on man only a douchebag will expect magic for 20 25 dollars Let's try to shoot. <laughs> I can't take him. There we go. Oh my god, I'm enjoying now playing this game. Anyway, that's it. Oh my god, six minutes. I said five minutes, but six minutes. Just enjoying playing these games with these super cheap game pads. It's amazing what they produce, what China produces, bro. I mean, just my salama. Remember, the buying links will be in the description. We played PES 2019 with the Ipega gamepad with the wired support.